WHDD presents Susan Says. I read my horoscope every day. I find it usually helps, especially when it keeps me from getting into trouble. No, I mean it. If I don't look at it, I always do something wrong. The New York Post horoscope. Yeah, I know, but I read others too, and lately all hell is broken loose. It's a mercury retrograde or everything retrograde or I don't know what, but bad stars have aligned. My life is going through bad stuff. So is the city, the country, the world. Supposedly, it will be better by October 18th when the stars align differently. Please, God, or whoever rules those heavenly bodies, make it happen. If one more person gets pushed into the subway, and the perp is always someone who has a bunch of prior arrests, keep them in jail. What is the problem? What don't you get about that? I don't care if the jail's a bad place. Another school shooting. Horrible. Horrific. Fortunately, no kids or teachers killed, but gun nuts still out there. And how in the hell did this student get into the school with the gun? Don't they need metal detectors in every school? I think they do. I hurt my wrist doing too much needlepoint. The only thing that calms me. So now I have no more peaceful place to go. I saw this thing called tapping. It's like, I don't know, a meditative thing. Tony Robbins, who I don't trust, but other people I do like, Wayne Dreyer and Ayanna Van Sant, or however you say her name. I love them. I'll try it. It's a meditation to calm me. Ha, ha, ha. It's pressure points. I tried it for a few days. One day I actually felt calm. The second day I didn't. I have ongoing issues in my building. Noise, and then again noise, and then again noise which make me feel anxious and unsafe and sorry I can't say more, but it sucks and lawyers are involved. Oh yeah, and then I fell, getting out of bed. I tripped on the phone cord. I put out my bad wrist, which is bandaged to save me, but I still hit my head, not too hard. So I guess I'm lucky. Yeah, it's that kind of week. Hurry up, stars, get aligned. Oh wait, one good thing happened. A federal judge in Texas blocked that awful bad guy Abbott six-week abortion ban. So maybe one star is going well. Thanks. Susan Silver was one of the original writers of such TV classics as The Mary Tyler Moore Show, Maud and Bob Newhart. She lectures and teaches sitcom writing and had a column on the New York Social Diary called The Search for Mr. Adequate. She hasn't found him yet. Appearing on TV and radio often, she expresses her views on life and opinions on everything.